Hey Peace Babes, if you like thrifting, flipping, crafting, and upcycling, then you've come to the right place. Today we're making a cardboard fireplace to go right there. The first thing we need is a whole bunch of boxes. We kept all of ours from moving. We got them all for free off of Facebook Marketplace. So I'm just going to gather a whole bunch up. Okay, so I said we were going to use the other boxes, but I changed my mind because these ones are all the same size, except for this box. The ones box apparently is a little bit smaller. We're going to use diaper boxes from Costco. Okay. Alright, so how are we going to do this? a bigger box in just two seconds. going to take a brief diaper changing intermission. Again! Let's go clean with Boston. <laughs> Pretty dang close. I think that's our one, Indy. Now that we have the blueprints, it's time to tape them up and tape them up. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Uh, I am. Boo. Okay, it is now all in three pieces because I forgot to do this part. But I'm going to cut it like here-ish so that it fits in perfectly. Oh, you know what? Maybe it already does. Never mind. I'll just tape it in there. And I had to put a Costco milk box in here and I taped it in there and so that... It has some support there, so I'll close this. I just wanted to show you guys. And that's it right now. Now, I want to paint this so that it doesn't look like a box of diapers. So I'm just gonna... Mark a general line where I need to paint the back box so that I don't have to paint the whole thing and waste paint. And then I am also going to try something so that I don't have to paint over the tape. And if it doesn't work, then it'll just be a waste of time, but I'm kind of hoping that it will. So don't judge me for what you're about to see. This is our recycling. We don't really have a recycling thing so I just hoard it under here until I have a minute and or remember to take it to my parents house where they do have recycling. Skylar hates it but this is 
me. So <laughs> I'm just going to go through here and try to pick out a whole bunch of newspaper. Okay, I don't know if this is okay, but I mixed tacky glue with water and I'm going to try to paint it on the newspaper and stick it to my box. Okay, I think that's going to work. It took a little bit of convincing for the corners and some of the edges, but I think it will be a lot easier to paint over newspaper than it would be to paint over tape. I'm going to put newspaper on all of my tape. Finally done. Now when it dries, I'm just going to go along the bottom and finish up the back as well. And while I'm waiting, I'm going to cut some cardboard. Okay, before we get too crazy, I'm going to go ahead and paint this square black. Sorry that the lighting is so bad, but I do my best work when my babies are sleeping, so. Okay, originally with these, I was thinking I'd do like rectangles here, and then the little pieces right here, and then do some across the top like this. Rectangles, but I kind of feel like maybe that's a little bit dated. And I want a, I want a modern fireplace. So now what I'm thinking is, I'll paint the inside black, and then we'll do like a gold border around the inside, like all the way around, right? And then I'll actually make, I'll make these go all the way up and all the way down, and these go all the way to the sides, and then we've got kind of like a... I don't know, like that thing that you see on Pinterest all the time, it's like boards and they're all the same color, I don't know how, what they're called. I'm thinking I'll cut some of these into like little bricks and then do bricks above and below the trim. And the sides will look like they're made of wood and the top and bottom will look like they are made of brick. Okay, my littlest one has been asleep for too long now, and I need to sleep when she sleeps, so I'm going to bed. It's now 4.30 in the afternoon, and I meant to get started this morning, but with two babies, you never know what's going to happen. And now, I'm going to see what colors of paint we have. These ones we got off of Facebook Marketplace because we're painting the entire house. The paint just came with all of the painting supplies that we needed, so. We've got like a creamy white. This one's called Glacier Mist. We've got dark gray and light gray, so I think we're gonna go with the more whitish ones. A real cookie. Cute. <laughs> So as you can see, I decided to forego my original design and did wood on top and brick on the bottom. Now we're just ready to paint. Okay. This cup was down inside of the paint. I guess that is the risk you run when you buy paint that has been used previously. What the heck? Look at that, that looks awful. That's the, from the newspaper. I didn't think about the newspaper shriveling up because of the wet paint. I ended up peeling it off on this side. This is tape, so it's not actually too awful to paint on. But it's not smooth either. Because it's got a wrinkle in it. Ugh! I'm 
I'm going to take a sponge and a couple different colors of white paint to make the bricks have a little bit more texture on them. Um, we are aborting this mission. Skylar doesn't like the orange, and I'm kind of not a super fan either. Plus, we've got a purple couch over here, so... Yeah. Oh, we're gonna try blue instead. Skylar says that he likes this blue, and I like this blue, and I'm not gonna mix anything with it. And then we'll see if I can find a different paper at Hobby Lobby or wherever to cover up the panels. A blank canvas. Now for the fun part. The first thing I do, do something dumb. Oh, now I just did another dumb thing. Oh. I'm not painting the panels, so I just wasted a whole bunch of paint. And then, oh, I did it again. My freaking paintbrush just dripped on my finished bricks. It does. It's blue. It is blue. And green. No. It's blue. Yeah, it's just blue. <laughs> What's happening? Indie baby. Ho, 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 ho. Alrighty, here is the finished product. If I were going to do things differently, I would not have used newspaper. And I would have just had these lines instead of these chunky bits here. The lines from taping the boxes together, but... I think overall it turned out pretty nice. It especially looks good from far away and far away in the camera is even better.